The chair declares the second session of the 117th Congress adjourned. Sinai die. <laughs>For the meeting of the 118th Congress of the United States, the House will come to order. The prayer will be offered by Chaplain Kibben. Would you pray with me? Eternal God, you spoke and the earth brought forth life. With a word, your spirit breathed into humanity the essence and purpose of our very being. Speak to us now, O Lord, 
and breathe into the body of the 118th Congress your word of truth and justice, compassion and wisdom. Give each member the guidance to be faithful stewards of this divine tasking and to wield this privilege carefully. Even as you grant us the favor to serve you in this place, remind us that amidst all the debate, you will always have the final word. And your word is alive and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword. Divide then our souls and spirits. Discern our thoughts and the intentions of our hearts, and may they be acceptable to you. Lay on the shoulders of these men and women the mantle of both responsibility and accountability. Nothing is hidden from your sight, and each will always answer to you. Call these who represent the hopes and dreams of the Americans who have voted them into office to heed first your voice. And then, as they uphold and defend the Constitution and its moral principles, grant them strength and reason, purpose and insight. So bring this 118th Congress to life and breathe on us the creative work of your Holy Spirit. Give us eyes to see your guiding hand, ears to hear your wise truth, and hearts to hold firmly to the faith we profess in you. We pray this in your most sovereign name. Amen. Amen. Will representatives elect and their guests remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance? We pledge allegiance to the flag. As directed by law, the Clerk of the House has prepared the official roll of the representatives elect. Certificates of election covering 435 seats and the 118th Congress have been received by the Clerk of the House. The names of those persons whose credentials show that they were regularly elected as representatives in accord with the laws of their respective states or of the United States will be called. The representatives elect will record their presence by electronic device and their names will be reported in alphabetical order by state, beginning with the state of Alabama to determine whether a quorum is present. Representatives elect will have a minimum of 15 minutes to record their presence by electronic vote. Representatives elect who have not obtained their voting ID cards may do so now in the speaker's lobby. Welcome to CSAN's coverage of the first day of the 118th Congress. You're watching live coverage here of the House floor. After four years of being in the minority, Republicans now have control of the chamber with a slim majority. There are 222 Republicans and 212 Democrats in the new Congress. There's currently one vacant seat following the death of Virginia Democrat Donald McEachin in November. A special election will be held in February to fill his seat. Right now, the clerk is establishing a quorum in the chamber with members recording their presence with their electronic voting cards. Once that is over, they'll begin the process of electing a speaker. For more on that, we're joined by Zach Cohen, who covers Congress for Bloomberg government. Zach Cohen, for the first time in 100 years, the House is on track to hold 
multiple ballots for speaker. Walk us through the election process. Usually election of a House speaker is a rather pro forma event. Members of one party vote for their preferred candidate, the majority of the minority leader, and members of the other party vote for their preferred candidate. The difference this time is that Kevin McCarthy is looking for that magic number of 218 votes. And because, as you mentioned, the majority is so slim, only 222 Republicans in the House now that this new 118th Congress is coming in, he can only afford to lose a handful of votes on that speaker vote. And there are as many as five, maybe as many as 20 Republicans that are getting ready to vote against him for that speakership. Unlike most caucus leader positions, it requires a majority of the whole House as opposed to a majority of just the conference or the caucus. And that's why that super narrow majority really plays in here. What will it look like on the floor when this vote gets underway? Unlike most House votes, usually C-SPAN watchers will see that members are kind of milling around, taking their voter cards, putting in the machines, registering their votes. It's a rather you know, free form affair. Unlike that, this is a much more formal process where each member, all 100, 434 of them, in this case, usually 435, will be called alphabetically and they will register their vote with the actual candidate that they are voting for. Most Republicans will vote for Kevin McCarthy, the Republican from California. Most Democrats will vote for uh, Hakeem Jeffries, the Democrat from New York. And then there are these uh, this faction of more conservative lawmakers, Republicans, that will vote for someone else, probably Andy Biggs, the Arizona Republican on that first ballot. Um, and as you mentioned, it hasn't been since 1923 that a House Speaker vote has gone to more than one ballot. So 99 years ago, December 1923, so this is a rather historic day. And so what happens after that first vote really uh, is up in the air right now. During that first vote, what is the magic number that Kevin McCarthy needs and what could the vote tally look like? He does need 218. He needs a majority of the House. Again, not just a majority of House Republicans, which he does have in a closed door session a couple of weeks ago. Republicans, most of them agreed that Kevin McCarthy, who is uh, the current uh, Republican leader, would be their nominee for speaker and who they would all vote against. But there are five Republicans that have said that they will absolutely vote against him. People like uh, Congressman Matt Gates um, or uh, Congresswoman Lauren Boebert uh, today, I believe, said that she would vote against uh, McCarthy for speaker. At, at this juncture. And that group right now, a lot of members of the House Freedom Caucus, the sort of arch conservative member of, members of the House Republican Caucus, are looking for rules changes that would basically empower them on certain issues. The main one being the motion to vacate the chair, basically a, 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 a way to oust the speaker. And normally that only takes, you know, a member to sort of call that motion. Um, but Republicans, especially in McCarthy's camp, would like a much larger number. The current compromise is five that they would require in order to call up that vote. And this is the same motion that basically ended the speakership of John Boehner. And so if they're not able to reach some sort of a consensus on these rules changes, those five or so Republicans are going to be keep voting against McCarthy until they come up with, you know, either some way to reach a consensus or maybe find a different candidate. So what could the second vote look like? And could that second vote when would that second vote take place? It should happen pretty much immediately after the first vote. The House really can't operate without a speaker, and so it really is the first thing they do. Even members elect are not even sworn in until a speaker is elected, technically. And so uh, we could see a, a potential quote unquote consensus candidate come about. This is somebody that uh, some of these Republicans that are moving against McCarthy have said that they will bring up on a second vote, not Andy Biggs, who is only expected to get a handful of votes, but maybe somebody that could get a wider swath of the Republican Party. And now they have not said who that candidate would be, uh, but Democrats have said that they're going to keep voting her for Hakeem Jeffries, and it's really up to Republicans to come up with somebody that can win the whole conference. Maybe it's somebody like a Steve Scalise, who's the incoming House uh, Majority Leader, the current whip. Um, he's sort of the number two in House Republican caucus and maybe could be that consensus candidate. Maybe it's somebody else. It doesn't have to be a member of the House, though it always has been. Um, and we were talking to Congressman Bob Good, uh, one of these Republicans that is voting against McCarthy, and said he doesn't really see a scenario where somebody who isn't a member of the House manages to get 218 votes. So this is a rather unprecedented situation. It's not totally clear what's going to happen next, uh, but certainly that second ballot is going to be instructive if they do get to it. Kevin McCarthy met with his rank and file members behind closed doors this morning. Tell us about that meeting. Yeah, so he got before, as according to sources in the room that, that spoke to me and my colleagues, he sort of made the pitch and said, I have earned this job. He's been in Congress for 16 years. He's been in the, the top leadership. He's been the, the Republican leader for the last couple of years. And he was the leader of the House Republican 
caucus that got them the majority. As narrow as it is, they are going to be in the majority and rather than minority. And so a lot of even very conservative lawmakers say, look, Kevin got us here and he should get the, the role of speaker as his reward. Um, he also made the case that you know he has been negotiating on these rule packages and last night or the night before rather they put out a sort of compromise rules package that included some of what these more conservative anti McCarthy caucus members are looking for but really wasn't enough to get their uh, approval and so McCarthy has said look I, I've tried to get uh, a consensus with them but we can't seem to reach an agreement and so he's really trying to make sure that especially if this goes to a second third or fourth battle Ballot, that the McCarthy forces really stay in line. And that's what they keep telling us. They're not entertaining anybody else at this juncture. What concessions did Kevin McCarthy make to this group of GOP conservatives? And what, what are they holding out for? The first one is the, that motion to vacate that I mentioned earlier, basically that idea that a member could go to the floor and say, I move to vacate the chair and basically hold a new election for speaker. Uh, anybody who has watched, uh, for instance, the parliament in the United Kingdom uh, go through this every time a prime minister is ousted would be rather familiar. It's sort of a similar dynamic. Um, right now, um, there are members of this arch conservative House Freedom Caucus that are looking for just one member to be able to call up that motion. In the rules package that was unveiled, they need five. Five members who basically all say, we agree there needs to be a motion to vacate the chair, we need to have a new election for the speaker. Now, there are members that want it to be one. There are McCarthy members that would like it to be much greater than that, um, and they haven't been able to reach an agreement on that. So that's really the first one. There have been a number of other changes, some of which have broader appeal, uh, things like changing budgetary rules uh, to make it harder to raise taxes um, or to increase the amount of time that lawmakers have to read bills. The official number is 72 hours between when a bill is, uh, is introduced and is you know, published. Uh, before I can then go to the floor in the House, obviously not the way the House has been operating in recent years, where typically a big bill will come out you know, 12, 24 hours before a vote. Uh, Republicans would like to see a little more time to digest this material. It's a, it's a rather long document, but those seem to be some of the key issues right now. What will happen with proxy voting in the 118th Congress? Proxy voting is a thing of the past. Um, it's something that ended with the 117th Congress that just ended. The 118th Congress doesn't have to do anything to reinstate it. The House Republicans have said for a long time that if they get the majority, that members will be voting in person. That is something they're going to make good on. That does make attendance particularly important. If they have Republicans that don't show up for a vote and Democrats do, that can change the outcome of a vote. If four or five Republicans miss the vote, but every Democrat shows up, Democrats would have a majority on the floor. And so it'll be up to Republicans as well as Democrats to make sure that members are here in Washington and voting. Committees are also going to be more in person than they used to. I believe there's a carve out for non-governmental officials to be able to testify remotely, to be able to bring in those diverse viewpoints that remote committee hearings have been able to incorporate. But government officials would have to come to Capitol Hill and subject themselves to congressional oversight as Republicans have been looking for. Zach Cohen, going back to this speakership uh, election, what's your prediction for how many rounds of balloting, how many votes will we see? It's hard to say at this point, 1923, I think it took nine ballots for Frederick Gillette, the Republican from Massachusetts, to get elected um, House Speaker, and that was the last time that a House Speaker election did go to multiple ballots. I believe it took three days. As I said, this is not a typical 15-minute vote in the House. This is something that all 434 members have to give their, uh, their candidate as they go through the roll call. Um, Congresswoman Ann Wagner earlier was saying, I brought my granola bars. I'm ready for a long night. So we'll, we'll have to see how long it goes. Zach Cohen, thank you very much. Sure thing. Let's take you back to the floor. We're watching members electronically uh, note their presence in the chamber. The clerk is establishing a quorum before we move on to that all-important speaker vote.
We are moments away here from the vote for speaker. In the meantime, they're establishing a quorum on the House floor. You can see right there on your screen some of the Republicans who have said uh, publicly that they are going to oppose Kevin McCarthy for speaker. It's Matt Gates right there in the lower part of your screen, uh, Andy Biggs of Arizona, who's been leading the opposition to Kevin McCarthy. He's sitting next to Ken Buck of Colorado. Uh, so those are some of the people that have said they are going to be voting no on this first ballot. And some of them said they will continue to vote no for Kevin McCarthy as speaker. Happening over in the Senate right now, uh, the Senate is swearing in its new members for the 118th Congress as well. There are seven new senators in that chamber, five Republicans, two Democrats. There are a total of 49 Republicans, 48 Democrats. Those Democrats joined by three independents to give them a two-vote majority. Chuck Schumer, serving in his fifth term, will remain as the majority leader for Democrats. And Mitch McConnell, serving in seventh term, will continue as minority leader for Republicans. Mitch McConnell, by the way, marking a milestone today. He becomes the longest-serving party leader uh, in, in the Senate, and he's expected to, if he hasn't already, give a speech to mark this occasion. Live coverage here on C-SPAN of the House floor over on C-SPAN 2, the Senate floor. Opening day of the 118th Congress, live coverage here on C-SPAN. On your screen with, your, with his back to you is the incoming Democratic leader, Hakeem Jeffries of New York. You're going to hear uh, later this morning, Pete Aguilar, this afternoon, I should say, 
Democrat of California, giving the nominating speech for Hakeem Jeffries. You're going to hear all 212, we expect Democrats, to vote for Hakeem Jeffries for speaker. He won't get the majority of votes that, are, that is needed for that. On the Republican side, Elise Stefanik is expected to give the nominating speech for Kevin McCarthy. Chad Pergram of Fox News tweeting out a quote from her earlier saying, I'm confident that Kevin is stronger than ever after that conference meeting this morning behind closed doors with rank and file Republicans. He'll be elected the next Speaker of the House. Scott Perry, one, who, one of the Republicans who could oppose him, who's chair of the Freedom Caucus, tweeting out fear and smear and comply or die messaging don't inspire trust, he says to the GOP leader, Kevin McCarthy. Those are tactics not benefiting the next House Speaker. As we said, the last time that the vote for Speaker went multiple ballots was in 1923. The nominee today must receive a majority of the total votes cast by name. By name. That's the important part of this. If a member votes present, it does not count towards the total number of votes cast. Anyone can be nominated. The nominee does not have to be a member of Congress. There have been 14 times where it took more than two ballots for a nominee to become Speaker. 13 of those instances occurred before the Civil War. The longest Speaker election on record lasted two months between December 1855 and February 1856. Lawmakers had to cast 133 ballots before finally electing a Speaker that time. And as we said, the last time it went multiple ballots, 100 years ago, when it took nine ballots to elect a Speaker, we will see what happens today. We are just minutes away from the Speaker vote taking place. Live coverage here on C-SPAN. As we watch the House establish a quorum here, I want to point out uh, George Santos, the representative elect, uh, sitting in the chamber right now. As you all know, he's made false claims about his background, education, and finances. Uh, he says that um, he will uh, continue to, to serve as of now. And he's sitting there looking at his phone as he uh, marks himself present for today's opening day of the 118th Congress. Uh, and expected to vote as well in this speaker vote.
incoming majority leader uh, Steve Scalise, Republican of Louisiana, on the floor right now talking to members while they're establishing this quorum call uh, in the House. He's making his way uh, up the aisle, talking to different Republicans, waiting to see what happens here with the speaker vote, which could get underway any minute here once the uh, clerk calls the total votes there, um, the, to the total number of people in the chamber marking themselves as present. That number will be key to see how many votes Kevin McCarthy needs. Uh, so today, there, this, the speaker election will take place, as we told you, after and if they are able to elect a speaker today, the newly elected speaker addresses the House. The dean of the House then, Hal Rogers, Republican of Kentucky, will be swearing in the speaker. And then the newly elected speaker swears in the House members. The House debates and votes on a rules package for the 118th Congress. And then the House also plans to consider its first piece of legislation, a bill to rescind funding for 87,000 new IRS agents that was allocated in the Inflation Reduction Act, which passed in the previous Congress, without any Republican support. This bill today would still need to pass the Senate to become law, which is unlikely with Democrats still in control of that chamber. Kevin McCarthy on the, on the House floor in the well right now, uh, taking pictures, shaking hands with members of, of Congress. He was uh, appointed their leader of the Republican Party by a majority. However, he needs to get 218 votes of Republicans today to become speaker. And he can only afford to lose four. We know publicly five members of the GOP have said that they are not going to vote for him. There could be up to 20, as we learn from reporting today, up to 20 Republicans who do not vote for Kevin McCarthy in this first round of voting. Kevin McCarthy represents the 20th district, first elected in 2006. This will be his ninth term in Congress, 57 years old. He served as minority leader from 2019 to 2023, just uh, moments ago. Up oh, there, gaveling down. Let's listen in. Are there additional representatives elect in the chamber who wish to record their vote? If not, all time has expired. 434 representatives elect have recorded their presence. A quorum is present. Credentials regular and form have been received showing the election of the Honorable Jennifer Gonzalez Colon as resident commissioner from the Commonwealth of Puerto Rico for a term of four years beginning January 3rd, 2021. The Honorable Eleanor Holmes Norton as delegate from the District of Columbia the Honorable James C. Milan as delegate from Guam, the Honorable Stacey E. Plaskett as delegate from the Virgin Islands, the Honorable Amu Amada Coleman Radawagon as delegate from American Samoa, and the Honorable Gregoria Kalia Camacho Sablan as delegate from the Commonwealth of the Northern Mariana Islands. The clerk will state that since the last regular election 
of Representatives to the 118th Congress, a vacancy now exists in the 4th District of the Commonwealth of Virginia, occasioned by the death of the late Honorable A. Donald McEachin. Pursuant to law and precedent, the next order of business is the election of the Speaker of the House of Representatives for the 118th Congress. Nominations are now in order. The clerk recognizes the gentlewoman from New York, Ms. Stefani. Madam Clerk, on behalf of the House Republican Conference, I rise today to nominate the gentleman from California, Kevin McCarthy, as Speaker of the House to lead America's new Republican majority. Just two years of failed one-party Democrat rule, the American people have suffered from a historic border crisis, rampant crime, crippling inflation, rising energy costs, runaway debt, unconstitutional attacks on our fundamental freedoms, and weakness at home and abroad. The people across this great nation spoke loudly and clearly that they wanted a new direction. They wanted a new direction to stop this radical far-left agenda, to hold Joe Biden accountable, and to save the United States of America. Under Kevin McCarthy's leadership, House Republicans drafted a bold vision to put our nation back on track. Our commitment to America is a promise to the American people that this new Republican majority will stand up for an economy that's strong, a nation that's safe, a future that's built upon freedom, and a government that's accountable to the people. Kevin McCarthy is the proud son of a firefighter and a fourth-generation Californian from Kern County, home to wildcatters, frontiersmen, and the right stuff. Bakersfield embodies the American spirit to work hard and dream big. This spirit that built our great nation is what we need in our next speaker. Kevin McCarthy is a strong conservative. He is proudly pro-life, a supporter of our Second Amendment rights, and he is committed to stopping wasteful government spending and shrinking the size of government. When Republicans last held the majority, Kevin helped to reduce domestic spending and lower the tax burden on hardworking American families. And as our Republican leader over the past several years, Kevin has taken the fight to one-party Democrat rule on behalf of the American people. He helped bring this historic border crisis to the nation national consciousness, a crisis Kevin made sure Democrats could no longer ignore. He fought for and succeeded in repealing the ill-advised military COVID vaccine mandate. And he stood on this very floor and spoke for a record eight hours and 35 minutes to not only delay the vote in the House, but to make the case that ultimately defeated Joe Biden and House Democrats' dangerous Build Back Broke legislation. No one, no one in this body has worked harder for this Republican majority than Kevin McCarthy. Since the day Kevin was elected as our leader, House Republicans have only gained seats and won. While Republicans in the Senate and state legislatures lost seats, House Republicans are the only ones who have consistently won because Kevin knows what we stand for, he knows when we should engage in the fight, and he knows how to build consensus. Importantly, Kevin has done the work of listening to all Americans, traveling to nearly every district in this country, fighting for conservative values, and fighting for the people that, we, that are committed to upholding them. Kevin has shown up 
in these communities of every member in our conference. And I can guarantee he has shown up in the districts of our many of our colleagues across the aisle as well. His relentless effort has yielded an extraordinary new House Republican majority that represents our cut country's greatness from all walks of life. When the last Congress gaveled in two years ago, every new Republican welcome to our conference was a woman, veteran, or minority. Today's House Republican Conference is the most diverse Republican conference in our nation's history. A seasoned legislator, an experienced leader, a friend to so many of us, a proud conservative with a tireless work ethic, Kevin McCarthy has earned the speakership of the People's House. Madam Clerk, as the chair of the Republican Conference, it is my high honor to present our conference's nominee for election to the office of the Speaker of the People's House, the Honorable Kevin McCarthy from the state of California. And I yield back. The clerk now recognizes the gentleman from California, Mr. Aguilar. Madam Clerk, I rise today at the direction of the House Democratic Caucus to place into nomination for election to the position of Speaker of the House of Representatives, the pride of Brooklyn, Hakeem Jeffries of New York. Today, Madam Clerk, House Democrats are united. <laughs> united by a speaker who will put people over politics. Hakeem Jeffries has worked his entire life to improve economic opportunity for all people. He is committed to strengthening the American dream by lowering costs for working families, building safer communities, by taking weapons of war off streets, and by creating good paying jobs in industries of the future. As we work to implement our historic legislative accomplishments of the last two years, House Democrats are united behind a speaker who wants to make things in America and bring home jobs that have been shipped overseas to write a tax code. to write a tax code that rewards hard work, not wealth, to invest in clean energy that reduces our country's dependence on fossil fuels. From voting rights to reproductive rights, we are united, Madam Clerk. We are unified behind a speaker who is an unapologetic advocate for protecting and expanding our freedoms. He does not traffic in extremism. He does not grovel to or make excuses for a twice impeached so-called former president. Yeah. Madam Clerk, he does not bend a knee to anyone who would seek to undermine our democracy. Because, Madam Clerk, that's not what leaders do. Because he understands what great leaders of this House understand, that this body and this institution are best equipped to serve the needs of this democracy and the beautiful mosaic of the members it sends. That our responsibility as members of this body is to protect the American dream and honor the sacrifice of the generations before us. 
like the sacrifice of a mother and a social worker who borrowed against her pension to put her children through school. Mom and dad were determined that their children would graduate without any debt so that they could pursue their dreams to the best of their ability, no matter the hardship or the sacrifice. Today, Hakeem's leadership style is quite simple. Spread love, it's the Brooklyn way. And it's born of this working class upbringing in that same borough, Hakeem and his brother were raised in the first home that their parents ever bought, thanks to their collectively bargained salary, and it's where they live today. It was in this house where his younger brother saw a future leader, where his mother saw a thoughtful, passionate young man, and where his father saw a competitor, whose GPA went up when his younger brother started high school. His family always at his side, some here with us today and some watching from home. His mom and dad, Kenny, JJ, Joshua, and his younger brother, Dr. Hassan Jeffries. Mrs. Jeffries and her husband told their sons, it doesn't matter what you do, but it has to be done in the service of people. And that's how Hakeem will lead. He's going to serve all of us so that we can best serve the American public. That selflessness, that commitment to success of those around you, is what shaped his career and what sh will shape our joint future together. He knows success isn't about personal achievement. He's a leader who will be with you in the beginning, whether it's your bill and an important priority in your district. He'll ride alongside you as you do the work, and he'll be there at the end to see you through. Because he knows that our success means that we can raise the quality of life for our constituents, creating better jobs and building safer communities. He has guided every step of the way by his faith and his mom, his mom instilled in him. Sunday mornings weren't always easy in the Jeffries house. The young man who knew he wanted to be a lawyer would argue with his mom about going to church that day. But failure is a good teacher. <laughs> he lost those arguments. And now Hakeem goes to church every weekend, sometimes that one where his church family is at Cornerstone Baptist, or somewhere else in the district where he can meet his constituents, where they are. He remembers that after church on Sundays, he'd go to Nano's house, where there was an open door at his grandmother's house for the entire neighborhood and their elders to come through with food and conversation. A young Hakeem listening to everything, but usually just trying to catch the score of the Jets game. <laughs> this is where wisdom gets passed down. And now, guided by the faith and wisdom of leaders like Jim Clyburn, Greg Meeks, John Lewis, Steny Hoyer, and Nancy D'Alessandro Pelosi. It is shaped by that guidance that we are prepared to nominate a leader who will open the door to the new generation of leadership. Madam Clerk, a Latino is nominating for leader of this chamber a black man for the first time in our history. <laughs> Madam, Madam Clerk, that's progress and it's progress that the country wants to continue for this Congress and for our country. Therefore, as chair of the Democratic Caucus, I am directed by the vote of that caucus to present for election to the Office of Speaker of the House of Representatives for the 118th Congress the name of the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries, representative-elect from the state of New York.
The names of the Honorable Kevin McCarthy, a representative elect from the state of California, and the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries, a representative elect from the state of New York, have been placed in nomination. Are there further nominations? The gentleman from Arizona is recognized. America knows that Washington is broken. The power doesn't reside in the speaker. It doesn't in the majority leader, nor the minority leader, nor the whips. The power resides in we, the people, the people who entrusted us here, each individual member, to represent their district, their state, and the federal government. Washington's broken. We're the last ones to know. A wise person once told me, good process builds good policy, builds good politics. We got to return to that. It is with that that I place the name of my friend and colleague from Arizona, Annie Biggs, for Speaker of the House. Thank you. Are there further nominations? There being no further nominations, the clerk appoints the following tellers. The gentleman from Georgia, Mr. Laudermilk. The gentlewoman from California, Ms. Lee. The gentleman from Wisconsin, Mr. Steele. And the gentleman from New York, Mr. Morelli. The tellers will come forward and take their seats at the desk in front of the speaker's rostrum. elect from the state of California, the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries, a representative elect from the state of New York, and the Honorable Andy Biggs, a representative elect from the state of Arizona, have been placed in nomination. The roll now will be called, and those responding to those names will indicate by surname the nominee of their choosing. The reading clerk will now call the roll. Jeffries. Amaday. McCarthy. Armstrong. McCarthy. Arrington. McCarthy. Auchincloss. 
Jeffries. Babin. McCarthy. Bacon. McCarthy. Baird. McCarthy. Balderson. McCarthy. Ballant. Jeffries. Banks. McCarthy. Barr. McCarthy. Berrigan. Jeffries. Bean of Florida. Gavin McCarthy. McCarthy. Beatty. I proudly pass my historic vote for Hockey and Jeff. Jeffries. Bentz. McCarthy. Barra. Jeffries. Bergman. McCarthy. McCarthy. Fire. Jeffries. Bice. McCarthy. Biggs. Biggs. Villarapas. McCarthy. Bishop of Georgia. Jeffries. Bishop of North Carolina. Biggs. Blumenauer. Jeffries. Blunt Rochester. Jeffries. Bobert. Jordan. Bonamici. <laughs> Jeffries. Bost. McCarthy. Bowman. Jeffries. Jeffries. Boyle of Pennsylvania. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Brakeen. Banks. Banks. Brown, Jeffries, Brownlee, Jeffries, Buchanan, McCarthy, Buck, McCarthy, Bushan. McCarthy, Bazinski, Jeffries, Jeffries. Burchett, McCarthy, Burgess, McCarthy, McCarthy. Burleson, McCarthy. McCarthy, Bush, Jeffries, Calvert, McCarthy, Kamek, Kamek, McCarthy, Caraveo, Jeffries, Carbajal, 
Akeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Cardenas. For the first speaker of color of the House of Representatives, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Carey. Probably McCarthy. McCarthy. Carl. Next speaker of the House of 118 Congress, Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Carson. Hakeem Jacob Jeffries. Jeffries. Carter of Georgia. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Carter of Louisiana. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Carter of Texas. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Cartwright. Jeffries. Jeffries. Kassar. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Case. Jeffries. Jeffries. Caston. Jeffries. Jeffries. Castor of Florida. Jeffries. Jeffries. Castro of Texas. Castro of Texas. Jeffries. Jeffries. Chavez de Reamer. <coughs> McCarthy. Sherfalis McCormick. Jeffries. Chu. Jeffries. Jeffries. Cicilline. Very proudly, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Siscobani. McCarthy. Clark of Massachusetts. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Clark of New York. The bad, brilliant brother of Brooklyn. <laughs> Jeffries. Cleaver. Jeffries. Klein. McCarthy. McCarthy. Cloud. Jim Jordan. Jordan. Clyburn. Jeffries. Jeffries. Clyde. Biggs. Cohen. I have eight times cast my vote from the greatest speaker of the generation and made the greatest speaker this house has ever known. Jeffries. Costa. Gentleman from New York, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Courtney. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Craig. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Crane. Thanks. Crawford, McCarthy, Crenshaw, McCarthy, Crockett, Jeffries, Crow, Jeffries, Quayar. Jeffries. Jeffries. Curtis. 
McCarthy. Davids of Kansas. Jeffries. Davidson. McCarthy. Davis of Illinois. <laughs> Jeffries. Davis of North Carolina. Jeffries. Jeffries. Dean of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. DeGette. Jeffries. Dela Cruz. From the great state of Texas, Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Deloro. Jeffries. Del Bene. Jeffries. Jeffries. Deluzio. Jeffries. Jeffries. Desaigne. Jeffries. Jeffries. Desjardins. McCarthy. D'Esposito. From Stromae, New York, Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Diaz Ballard. McCarthy. Dingle. Akeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Doggett. Akeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Donalds. McCarthy. McCarthy. Duarte. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Duncan. McCarthy. Dunn of Florida. McCarthy. Edwards. McCarthy. Elsie. McCarthy. Emmer. McCarthy. Escobar. Jeffries. Jeffries. Eshu. Jeffries. Jeffries. Espayat. Don't know, now you know. <laughs> Jeffries. Estes. McCarthy. Evans. Jeffries. Ezel. McCarthy. Fallon. Fourth District of Texas votes for Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Finstra. McCarthy. Ferguson. McCarthy. Finstad. McCarthy. McCarthy. Fishbach. McCarthy. Fitzgerald. McCarthy. Fitzpatrick. McCarthy. Fleischman. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Fletcher. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Flood. McCarthy. McCarthy. Foster. <coughs> Jeffries. Fushi. Jeffries. Jeffries. Fox. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Lois Frankel. Jeffries. Jeffries. C. Scott Franklin. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Frost. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Fry. McCarthy. Fulcher. McCarthy. Gates. Andy Biggs. Biggs.
Gallagher. Aye. McCarthy. Gallego. I vote for the current vote leader, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Garamendi. Jeffries. Garbarino. McCarthy. Mike Garcia. McCarthy. Robert Garcia. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Garcia of Illinois. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Garcia of Texas. Jeffries. Jimenez. McCarthy. Golden of Maine. Jeffries. Jeffries. Goldman of New York. Jeffries. Gomez. Jeffries. Tony Gonzalez. McCarthy. Vicente Gonzalez. Jeffries. Good of Virginia. Biggs. Gooden of Texas. McCarthy. Gosar. Biggs. Gottheimer. Jeffries. Granger. McCarthy. Graves of Louisiana. McCarthy. Graves of Missouri. McCarthy. Green of Tennessee. McCarthy. Green of Texas. Jeffries. Green of Georgia. McCarthy. Griffith. McCarthy. Grijalva. Jeffries. Grothman. McCarthy. Guest. McCarthy. Guthrie. McCarthy. Hageman. McCarthy. Harder of California. Jeffries. Harris. Zeldin. Harshbarger, McCarthy, Hayes, Jeffries, Hearn, McCarthy, Higgins of Louisiana, McCarthy, Higgins of New York, Jeffries, Hill, McCarthy, Himes, Jeffries, Henson, McCarthy, Horsford, Jeffries, Houchin, McCarthy, Houlihan, 
Jeffries. Hoyer. Jeffries. Hoyle of Oregon. Jeffries. Hudson. Judy McCarthy's husband, Kevin. McCarthy. Huffman. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Hyzinga. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Hunt. McCarthy. McCarthy. Isa. McCarthy. McCarthy. Ivy. Jeffries. Jackson of Illinois. Jeffries. Jackson of North Carolina. Jeffries. Jackson of Texas. McCarthy. Jackson Lee. Jeffries. Jacobs. Jeffries. James. McCarthy. Jayapal. Jeffries. Jeffries. Jeffries, Johnson of Georgia. Jeffries, Johnson of Louisiana. McCarthy, Johnson of Ohio. McCarthy, Johnson of South Dakota. McCarthy, Jordan. McCarthy. Joyce of Ohio. McCarthy. McCarthy. Joyce of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. McCarthy. Cam Logger Dove. Representing California's 37th district, Jeffries, all the way. Jeffries. Captor. Kane of New Jersey. McCarthy. McCarthy. Keating. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Kelly of Illinois. <laughs> Jeffries. Kelly of Mississippi. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Kelly of Pennsylvania. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Connor. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Kickens of Virginia. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Kildee. Ma'am, Brooklyn, my class is 2012. I read Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Killy. <laughs> McCarthy. Kilmer, Jeffries, Kim of California, McCarthy, Kim of New Jersey, Jeffries, Krishnamurthy, Jeffries, Custer, Jeffries, Kustoff, McCarthy, LaHood, McCarthy. Loida, McCarthy, LaMalfa,
McCarthy. Lamborn. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Landsman. I proudly cast my vote for, uh, and enthusiastically cast my vote for Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Langworthy. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Larson of Washington. Jeffries. Larson of Connecticut. Jeffries. Latta. McCarthy. Laturner. McCarthy. Lawler. McCarthy. Lee of California. Jeffries. Lee of Florida. McCarthy. Lee of Nevada. Jeffries. Lee of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. Jeffries. Ledger Fernandez. Jeffries. Lesko. McCarthy. Letlow. McCarthy. Levin. Jeffries. Lou. Jeffries. Lofgren. Jeffries. Loudermilk. McCarthy. Lucas. McCarthy. Luke Kameyer. McCarthy. Luna. Jordan. Latrell. McCarthy. Lynch. Jeffries. Mace. Kevin McCarthy. Magaziner. Jeffries. Maliotakis. McCarthy. Mann. McCarthy. Manning. Jeffries. Massey. McCarthy. Mast. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Matsui. Jeffries. McBath. Jeffries. McCarthy. 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 McCall. McCarthy. McLean. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. McClintock. McCarthy. McCarthy. McCullum. Jeffries. Jeffries. McCormick. McCarthy. McCarthy. McGarvey. Jeffries. McGovern. Jeffries. McHenry. McCarthy. Meeks. I can proudly cast my vote for the pride of New York and soon to be the pride of these United States of America, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries.
Menendez. Jeffries. Maine. Jeffries. Muser. Nobody but Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Mfume. Madam Clerk, on this historic day, I am proud to cast my vote for the distinguished gentleman from New York, the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Miller of Illinois. Jordan. Jordan. Miller of Ohio. McCarthy. McCarthy. Miller of West Virginia. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Miller Meeks. McCarthy. McCarthy. Mills. McCarthy. McCarthy. Molinaro. McCarthy. McCarthy. Molinar. McCarthy. Mooney. McCarthy. Moore of Alabama. McCarthy. Moore of Utah. McCarthy. Moore of Wisconsin. Jeffries. Moran. McCarthy. Morelli. Jeffries. Moskowitz. Jeffries. Moulton. Jeffries. Mervan. Representing Gary, Indiana, probably Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Mullen. Jeffries. Jeffries. Murphy. McCarthy. McCarthy. Nadler. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Napolitano. Jeffries. Neal. Jeffries. Nagus. Jeffries. Nels. McCarthy. Newhouse. McCarthy. Nickel. Jeffries. Norcross. The Honorable Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Norman. Biggs. None of Iowa. McCarthy. Obernulty. McCarthy. Ocasio Cortez. Jeffries. Ogles. American Patriot, gentleman from Ohio, Jim Jordan. Jordan. Omar. Jeffries. Owens. McCarthy. Pallone. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Palmer. McCarthy. Panetta. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Pappas. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Pasquale. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Payne.
Jeffries. Pelosi. Peltola, Jeffries, Pence, McCarthy, Perez, Jeffries, Perry, Biggs. Peters, Jeffries, Pedersen, Jeffries, Pfluger, McCarthy, Phillips, Jeffries, Pingreen, Jeffries, Pocan, Jeffries, Porter, Jeffries, Posey, McCarthy, Presley, Jeffries, Quigley, Jeffries, Ramirez, this Latina from the Illinois Third Congressional District votes for the speaker that's going to defend immigrant rights. Hakeem Jeffries. Yeah. Jeffries. Raskin. Hakeem Jeffries. Yeah. Jeffries. Rushenthaler. McCarthy. Rogers of Washington. McCarthy. Rogers of Alabama, McCarthy. McCarthy, Rogers of Kentucky, McCarthy, McCarthy. Rose, McCarthy. McCarthy, Rosendell, Montana Second District votes for Andy Biggs. Biggs. Ross, Jeffries, Rouser, McCarthy, Roy, Donalds, Donalds, Ruiz, Jeffries, Ruppersberger, Jeffries, Rutherford, McCarthy. Ryan, Jeffries. Jeffries, Salazar, <coughs> McCarthy, Salinas, Jeffries, Sanchez, Jeffries, Santos, McCarthy, Sarbanes, Jeffries, Jeffries. Scalise, 
McCarthy. Scanlon. <laughs> Jeffries. Shakowski. Jeffries. Jeffries. Ship. Jeffries. Snyder. With pride for promise for the people, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Skolton. Jeffries. Schreier. Jeffries. Swigert. McCarthy. McCarthy. Austin Scott. McCarthy. David Scott. Jeffries. Scott of Virginia. Jeffries. Self. Jim Jordan. Jordan. Sessions. McCarthy. Sewell. I proudly cast my vote for the Prince of the People's Republic of Brooklyn. <laughs> Jeffries. Sherman. Jeffries. Jeffries. Cheryl. Hakeem Jeffries. <laughs> Jeffries. Simpson. Son of a California firefighter, Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Slotkin. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Smith of Missouri. Kevin Owen McCarthy. McCarthy. Smith of Nebraska. McCarthy. McCarthy. Smith of New Jersey. McCarthy. Smith of Washington. Jeffries. Smucker. McCarthy. Sorensen. Jeffries. Soto. Jeffries. Jeffries. Spamberger. Jeffries. Sparts. McCarthy. Stansbury. On behalf of the great state of New Mexico, I proudly cast my ballot for the brilliant, eloquent, and amazing next speaker in the house, Hakeem Jeffries. Yeah! Jeffries. Stanton. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Stauber. McCarthy. Steele. McCarthy. Stefanik. McCarthy. McCarthy. Style. McCarthy. Stubby. McCarthy. Stevens. Probably the King Jeffries. Jeffries. Stewart. McCarthy. McCarthy. Strickland. Without hesitation, I proudly cast my vote for Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Strong. McCarthy. Swalwell. Jeffries. Sykes. Jeffries. Takano. I am a team Hakeem Sekou Jeffries. Jeffries. Tenny. McCarthy. Tanadar. Proudly from Detroit, Michigan. Jeffries. Thompson of California. Jeffries. Jeffries. Thompson of Mississippi. Team Jeffries. Jeffries. Thompson of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Tiffany. McCarthy. Timmons. McCarthy. Titus. 
Jeffries. To lead. Jeffries. Takuda. From the great state of Hawaii, we vote Team Jeffries. Jeffries. Tonko. Jeffries. Torres of California. Jeffries. Torres of New York. Master of Alliteration, the Cerebral Pool Comic Collection. <laughs> Jeffries. Trahan. Jeffries. Trone. Mr. Jeffries. Jeffries. Turner. McCarthy. McCarthy. Underwood. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Belladeo. <coughs> McCarthy. Van Drew. Mr. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Van Dyne. McCarthy. Van Orden. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Vargas. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Vasquez. New Mexico for Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. VC. Jeffries of New York. Jeffries. Velasquez. The one and only Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Wagner. McCarthy. McCarthy. Wahlberg. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Waltz. McCarthy. McCarthy. Wasserman Schultz. The full heart. Jeffries. Waters. <coughs> Jeffries. Watson Coleman. With our hearts raised upon the preservation of democracy and the protection of integrity, I pass my bill to my community. Jeffries, Weber of Texas, McCarthy. McCarthy, Webster of Florida, McCarthy, Winstrup, McCarthy, Westerman, McCarthy, Wexton, Jeffries, Wild. Jeffries. Williams of Georgia. Madam Clark, in the spirit of good trouble, and an answer goes for Hockey Jeffries. Jeffries. Williams of New York. McCarthy. Williams of Texas. McCarthy. Wilson of Florida. Jeffries. Wilson of South Carolina. McCarthy. Whitman. McCarthy. Womack. McCarthy. Yaka. McCarthy. Zinke. McCarthy.
First round of balloting for the speaker, and it's clear that uh, Kevin McCarthy, the Republican leader, does not have the votes. There are 19 defections, 10 Republicans voting for Andy Biggs of Arizona, nine voting for others. You could see by our count, uh, Hakeem Jeffries, the Democratic leader, has more votes than Kevin McCarthy at 211 to 202. He will not become speaker, though, because you need the majority of the votes cast. 218 is the number he would need. There are only 212 Democrats, so he would need six Republicans to vote for him. You won't see that happen today. It looks like we're headed toward another round of votes.
Republican leader Kevin McCarthy appears to have not uh, secured the votes he needed to become speaker. It looks like we're headed towards a, a second ballot. Jake Sherman tweeting out, sources tell me Team McCarthy wants to move directly into a second ballot. You may have seen Jim Jordan, one of his allies, on the floor talking to Kevin McCarthy. Jake Sherman saying Jordan making the rounds on the floor to whip his supporters uh, in, to vote for Kevin McCarthy. Andy Biggs, who opposed him, nominated for the vote as well, the, re the Republican from Arizona, he's, he tweeted out, we barely got through half the ballot before confirming that McCarthy is still well short of 218 votes. My colleagues have made clear that our party deserves a new leader. McCarthy should stand down and allow us to select someone else in the next ballot. 19 defections, uh, 19 Republicans voting for someone else other than Kevin McCarthy.
Live coverage here in C-SPAN of the vote for speaker. We're still waiting to see what comes next after this first round of balloting. Kevin McCarthy, you can see right there on the floor, failed to get the votes he needed to become speaker. Deidre Walsh of NPR tweeting out that Ohio Representative Jim Jordan compared notes with Kevin McCarthy and team and standing to make a motion after tally on first failed ballot. Uh, standing right there, you can see at the podium, he's expected to make some sort of motion here shortly. Jordan Carney, who reports for Politico, tweets out that McCarthy was asked just now, this is around 1.51 p.m., about the possibility the speaker's race lasts for days, quote, it could, is how he responded. Waiting for the clerk to say what happens next after the first round of ballots failed to produce a speaker here. Kevin McCarthy uh, says that he'll he'll keep voting. He'll keep uh, he'll stick around to see if he can get the votes he needs. Sarah Ferris of Politico tweeting out hearing chatter among ours that McCarthy will ask Jim Jordan there on your screen to deliver nominating speech for the next ballot in attempt to pressure those no votes to flip. This would come after several GOPers cast votes for Jordan instead of Kevin McCarthy in the last round. There were a total of 19 Republicans who voted for someone else other than Kevin McCarthy. Leader McCarthy would need to flip 15 of those 19 to secure the votes he needs.
The House will be in order. The House will be in order. The House will be in order. The tellers agree in their tallies that the total number of votes cast is 434, of which the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries of the State of New York has received 212. Kevin McCarthy of the state of California has received 203. The Honorable Andy Biggs of the state of Arizona has received 10. The Honorable Jim Jordan of the State of Ohio has received six. The Honorable Jim Banks of the State of Indiana has received one. The Honorable Lee Zeldin of the State of New York has received one. The Honorable Byron Donalds of the State of Florida has received one. No persons having received a majority of the whole number of votes cast by surname, a speaker has not been elected. Following the procedure used by the House in 1923 and recorded in Canon's Precedent, Volume 6, Section 24, the clerk is prepared to direct the reading clerk to call a roll anew. For what purpose does the gentleman from Ohio seek recognition? I rise to nominate Kevin McCarthy for Speaker of the House. The gentleman is recognized. Uh, thank you, Madam Clerk. Um, I think we have three objectives this Congress, three fundamental things we have to get done in the 118th Congress. First, pass the bills that fix the problems. In two years' time, we have, went, we, we have a border that is no longer a border. We have a military that can't meet its recruitment goals. We have bad energy policy, bad education policy, record spending, record inflation, record debt, and a government that has been weaponized against we the people, against the very people we represent. So we, we need to pass legislation to address all that. And I hope my Democrat colleagues will join me. I really do. But I have my doubts. And if they don't, and if Chuck Schumer says, no, we're not going to take up that legislation that we pass, and if Joe Biden won't sign it, so be it. They'll have to, they'll have to answer to the people in 2024. Second, second, we can never, ever let a bill like the one that passed 12 days ago, $1.7 trillion spent, we can never, ever let that kind of legislation pass again. We, We have, to, we have to pass a budget that makes sense, that's good common sense, then do the 12 appropriation bills that, that, are, that recognize it's the people's money, not ours, and send it to the Senate, and then stand firm on that legislation. And again, if they won't take it up, and Joe Biden won't sign it, we can stand firm on a CR or something. We can have that fight, but we are not going to have what took place a week and a half ago ever happen again. And then finally, third, and this is important. 
We got to do the oversight, do the investigations. We have to do the oversight and the investigations that need to be done. This idea that bureaucrats who never put their name on a ballot but think they run the country, who have assaulted our constituents' First Amendment liberties, they need to be held accountable. That has to happen. We need to do it. We need to do it in a way that's consistent with the Constitution, but we need to do it vigorously and aggressively. That is part of our duty as members of this body. To my friends here on this side of the aisle, I would just say this. The differences we may have, the differences between Joyce and Jordan or Biggs and Bacon, they pale in comparison to the differences between us and the left, which now unfortunately controls the other party. So we had better... We had better come together and fight for these key things, these three things. That's, that's what the people want us to do. And I think Kevin McCarthy is the right guy to lead us. I really do, or I wouldn't be standing up here giving this speech. I, I came in with Kevin. We came in the same time 16 years ago. We haven't always agreed on everything, but I like his fight. I like his tenacity, and I like the... I remember Kevin told me, I actually wrote about this in a book. I remember Kevin told me, he said, when the, the toughest times in life are when you get knocked down, the question is, can you come back? And I've always seen him be able to do that. We need to rally around him, come together, and deal with these three things. Because this is what the people sent us here to do. My favorite scripture verse is 2 Timothy 4, 7. Paul's the old guy giving advice to the young guy. And he says, fight the good fight, finish the course, keep the faith. I like the verse because it's a verse of action. Fight, finish, keep. Not wimpy words words that I think fit America. That's what the American people want us to do. They want us to fight for the things they care about and they elected us to do. And we should all remember, we should all remember, only about 12,000 people have ever had the opportunity to do what we're doing today, sit in this body, serve in this Congress. It is a privilege. It is an opportunity. We owe it to them, the American people, the good people of this great country, to step forward, to come together Get a speaker elected so we can address these three things. I hope you'll vote for Kevin McCarthy, and that's why I'm proud to nominate him for Speaker of the House. For what purpose does the gentleman from California rise? Thank you, Madam Clerk. We're witnessing history here today. I wasn't, for half of that, I wasn't quite sure who the gentleman from Ohio was nominating. He was nominating himself. And Is the gentleman rising to place a name and nomination? I am. I, I am, Madam Clerk. I am. I'd just like to be afforded the, the same opportunity that the gentleman from Ohio took, Madam Clerk. Consider, consider all that's happened. The last time an election for speaker went to a second ballot, Leader Jeffrey's beloved New York Yankees had not yet won a World Series. Consider all that's happened since then. The work that the body has entertained, the work that we've done for the people over that time. We are unified behind a speaker who will continue that progress despite the chaos on the other side, Madam Clerk. We are going to stay here to get this done. We are unified, and we are all going to support Hakeem Jeffries for speaker. The lead vote getter, the lead vote getter in the last ballot. Madam Clerk, as chair of the Democratic Caucus, I'm directed by the vote of the caucus to present for election to the Office of Speaker of the House of Representatives for the 118th Congress the name of the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries, the representative elect for the state of New York, once again, and we will be unified once again in our support for him. For what purpose does the gentleman from Florida rise? To nominate a candidate for Speaker of the House. The gentleman is recognized. Well, sometimes we have to do jobs that we don't really want to do. And sometimes we have to do jobs that we are called to do. And so, my colleagues, I rise to nominate 
the most talented, hardest working member of the Republican conference who just gave a speech with more vision than we have ever heard from the alternative, I'm nominating Jim Jordan. Jim Jordan is humble, perhaps today humble to a fault, maybe the right person for the job of Speaker of the House isn't someone who wants it so bad. Maybe the right person for the job of Speaker of the House isn't someone who has sold shares of themselves for more than a decade to get it. Maybe Jim Jordan is the right person for Speaker of the House because he is not beholden to the lobbyists and special interests who have corrupted this place and corrupted this nation under the leadership of both Republicans and Democrats. Maybe Jim Jordan would be the right person for Speaker of the House because he wouldn't fight us when we try to get a term limits bill on the floor. Maybe Jim Jordan would be the right person because he wouldn't fight us when we try to put a balanced budget on the floor and vote for it. And maybe Jim Jordan is the right person because he would endorse the plan that was built by the Texas delegation to finally secure our border. Mr. Jordan said in his nomination that there are certain bills that we have to pass to fix the problem. The challenge is the alternative has been someone voting for the very bills that have caused these problems. Mr. Jordan says that we cannot accept legislation like the omnibus, and I fully agree. And if Jim Jordan were Speaker of the House, if he were the leader of the Republican team, we wouldn't have that circumstance choking the economy of our country, increasing inflation, and diminishing the prospects of a better life for our fellow Americans. And finally, Mr. Jordan said we must engage in rigorous oversight. Every one of my Republican colleagues knows that the person who can lead that oversight effort, who works on it every day, who has the skill and the talent and the will, is Jim Jordan. I'm nominating him, and I'm voting for him. The reading clerk will call the roll. Jeffries. Adderholt. McCarthy. Aguilar. Jeffries. Alford. McCarthy. Allen. McCarthy. Allred. Jeffries. Amode. McCarthy. Armstrong. McCarthy. Arrington. McCarthy. Auchincloss. Jeffries. Jeffries. Babin, McCarthy, Bacon, McCarthy, Baird, McCarthy, Balderson, McCarthy, Ballant, Jeffries, Banks, McCarthy. Barr. McCarthy. McCarthy. Medagon. Jeffries. Bean of Florida. McCarthy. Beatty. For the second time, I proudly can't 
Jeffries. Vince. McCarthy. Barra. Jeffries. Bergman. McCarthy. Byer. Jeffries. Vice. McCarthy. Biggs. Jordan. Filarakis. McCarthy. Bishop of Georgia. Jeffries. Bishop of North Carolina. Jordan. Lumenauer. Jeffries. Blunt Rochester. Jeffries. Bobert. Jordan. Fonamichi. Jeffries. Bost. McCarthy. Bowman. Jeffries. Boyle of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. Rakeen. Jordan. Brown. Jeffries. Brownlee. Jeffries. Buchanan. McCarthy. Buck. McCarthy. Ushan. McCarthy. Budzinski. Jeffries. Burchett. McCarthy. Burgess. McCarthy. Burleson. McCarthy. Bush. Jeffries. Calvert. McCarthy. Kamick. McCarthy. Caraveo. Jeffries. Carbajal. Jeffries. Cardenas. I vote for the first speaker of color of the United States House of Representatives, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Carey. McCarthy. Carl. McCarthy. Carson. Jeffries. Jeffries. Carter of Georgia. McCarthy. Carter of Louisiana. Carter of Louisiana votes Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Carter of Texas. McCarthy. Cartwright. Jeffries. Jeffries. Kassar. Jeffries. Case. Jeffries. Caston. Jeffries. Caster of Florida. Jeffries. Castro of Texas. Jeffries. 
Chavez de Reamer. McCarthy. Sheerfulis McCormick. Jeffries. Chu. Jeffries. Cicilline. Jeffries. Siscomani. McCarthy. Clark of Massachusetts. Jeffries. Clark of New York. Jeffries. Cleaver. Jeffries. Klein. McCarthy. Cloud. Jordan. Clyburn. Jeffries. Clyde. Jordan. Cohen. Jeffries. Cole. McCarthy. Collins. McCarthy. Comer. McCarthy. Connolly. Jeffries. Correa. Jeffries. Costa. Costa. Courtney. Jeffries. Craig. Jeffries. Crane. Jordan. Crawford. McCarthy. Crenshaw. McCarthy. Crockett. Jeffries. Crow. Jeffries. Cuellar. Jeffries. Curtis. McCarthy. Davids of Kansas. Jeffries. Davidson. McCarthy. Davis of Illinois. Davis of Illinois. Jeffries. Davis of North Carolina. Jeffries. Jeffries. Dean of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. To get Jeffries De La Cruz McCarthy Delomro Deloro Del Bene Jeffries Deluzio. Jeffries. Jeffries. Desaunier. Jeffries. Jeffries. Desjardins. McCarthy. D'Esposito. McCarthy. Diaz Bellart. McCarthy. Dingo. Jeffries. Doggett. Jeffries. Donalds. McCarthy. 
Duarte. McCarthy. Duncan. McCarthy. Dunn of Florida. McCarthy. Edwards. McCarthy. Elsie. McCarthy. Emmer. McCarthy. Escobar. Jeffries. Eshoo. Jeffries. Espayat. Jeffries. Estes. McCarthy. Evans. Jeffries. Ezel. McCarthy. Fallon. McCarthy. Feenstra. McCarthy. Ferguson. McCarthy. Finstad. McCarthy. Fishbach. McCarthy. Fitzgerald. McCarthy. Fitzpatrick. McCarthy. Fleischman. McCarthy. Fletcher. Jeffries. Flood. McCarthy. Foster. Jeffries. Fushi. Jeffries. Fox. McCarthy. Lois Frankel. Jeffries. C. Scott Franklin. McCarthy. Frost. Jeffries. Fry. McCarthy. Fulcher. McCarthy. Gates. Jim Jordan. Jordan. Gallagher. McCarthy. Gallego. Gallego. Garamendi. Jeffries. Garbarino. McCarthy. Mike Garcia. McCarthy. Robert Garcia. Jeffries. Garcia of Illinois. Jeffries. Garcia of Texas. Jeffries. Jimenez. McCarthy. Golden of Maine. Jeffries. Goldman of New York. Jeffries. Gomez. Jeffries. Tony Gonzalez. McCarthy. Vicente Gonzalez. Jeffries. Good of Virginia. Jordan. Gooden of Texas. McCarthy. Gosar. Jordan.
Scott Heimer. Jeffries. Granger. McCarthy. Graves of Louisiana. McCarthy. Graves of Missouri. McCarthy. Green of Tennessee. McCarthy. Green of Texas. Jordan. <laughs> Harshbarger. McCarthy. Hayes. Jeffries. Hearn. McCarthy. Higgins of Louisiana. McCarthy. Higgins of New York. Jeffries. Jeffries. Hill. McCarthy. McCarthy. Himes. Jeffries. Henson. McCarthy. Horsford. For the people. For Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Houchin. McCarthy. Houlihan. Jeffries. Hoyer. Jeffries. Hoyle of Oregon. Jeffries. Hudson. McCarthy, Huffman, <laughs> Jeffries, <laughs> Heisinga, <laughs> McCarthy, Hunt, <laughs> McCarthy, Isa, <laughs> McCarthy, Ivy, Jeffries. Jackson of Illinois. Illinois first district proudly supports Speaker Hartini Jeffries. Jeffries. Jackson of North Carolina. Jeffries. Jeffries. Jackson of Texas. Kevin McCarthy. McCarthy. Jackson Lee. John Lewis, former Lord and Elijah Cummings, I proudly stand to vote for Speaker McKean Jeffries. Jeffries. Jacobs? Jeffries. James. McCarthy. Jayapal. Jeffries. 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 
Johnson of Georgia. Jeffries. Johnson of Louisiana. McCarthy. Johnson of Ohio. McCarthy. Johnson of South Dakota. McCarthy. Jordan. McCarthy. Joyce of Ohio. McCarthy. Joyce of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Kim Lager Dove. Jeffries. Captor. Jeffries. Kane of New Jersey. McCarthy. Keating. Jeffries. Kelly of Illinois. Jeffries. Kelly of Mississippi. McCarthy. Kelly of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Kana. Jeffries. Kiggins of Virginia. McCarthy. Kildee. Jeffries. Kylie. McCarthy. Kilmer. Jeffries. Kim of California. McCarthy. Kim of New Jersey. Jeffries. Krishnamurthy. Jeffries. Custer. Jeffries. Kustoff. McCarthy. LaHood. McCarthy. Laloda. McCarthy. Lamalfa. McCarthy. Lamborn. McCarthy. Landsman. Jeffries. Langworthy. McCarthy. Larson of Washington. Jeffries. Larson of Connecticut. Jeffries. Latta. McCarthy. Laturner. McCarthy. Lawler. Lawler. McCarthy. Lee of California. Jeffries. Lee of Florida. McCarthy. Lee of Nevada. Jeffries. Lee of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. Ledger Fernandez. Jeffries. Lesko. McCarthy. Letmo. McCarthy. Levin. Jeffries. Lou. Jeffries. Lofgren. Jeffries. Loudermilk. McCarthy. Lucas. McCarthy. Luke Kamire. McCarthy. Luna. 
Jordan. Latrell. McCarthy. Lynch. Jeffries. Mace. McCarthy. Magaziner. Jeffries. Maliotakis. McCarthy. Mann. McCarthy. Manning. Jeffries. Massey. McCarthy. Mast. McCarthy. Matsui. Jeffries. McBath. Jeffries. McCarthy. McCarthy. McCall. McCarthy. McLean. McCarthy. McClintock. McCarthy. McCullum. Jeffries. McCormick. McCarthy. McGarvey. Jeffries. McGovern. Jeffries. McHenry. McCarthy. Meeks. Jeffries. Menendez. Jeffries. Mang. Jeffries. Muser. McCarthy. Mfume. Jeffries. Miller of Illinois. Jordan. Miller of Ohio. McCarthy. Miller of West Virginia. McCarthy. Miller Meeks. McCarthy. Mills. McCarthy. Molinero. McCarthy. Molinar. McCarthy. Mooney. McCarthy. Moore of Alabama. McCarthy. Moore of Utah. McCarthy. Moore of Wisconsin. Jeffries. Moran. McCarthy. Morelli. Jeffries. Moskowitz. Jeffries. Moulton. Jeffries. Mervan. Jeffries. Mullen. Jeffries. Murphy. McCarthy. Nadler. Nadler. Jeffries. Napolitano. Jeffries. Neal. Jeffries. Nagoose. Jeffries. Nails. McCarthy. Newhouse. McCarthy. Nickel. Jeffries. Norcross. Jeffries. 
Norman. Jordan. Nunn of Iowa. McCarthy. Obernolte. McCarthy. Ocasio Cortez. Jeffries. Ogles. Jordan. Omar. Jeffries. Owens. McCarthy. Pallone. Jeffries. Palmer. McCarthy. Panetta. Jeffries. Pappas. Jeffries. Pasquale. Jeffries. Payne. Jeffries. Pelosi. Jeffries. Peltola. Jeffries. Pence. McCarthy. Perez. Jeffries. Perry. Jordan. Peters, Jeffries, Pedersen, Jeffries, Fluger, McCarthy, Phillips, Jeffries, Pingree, Jeffries, Pocan, Jeffries, Porter, Jeffries, Posey, McCarthy, Presley, Jeffries, Quigley, Jeffries, Ramirez, Jeffries, Raskin, Jeffries, Reschenthaler, McCarthy, Rogers of Washington, McCarthy. Rogers of Alabama, McCarthy. Rogers of Kentucky, McCarthy. Rose, McCarthy. Rosendale, Jordan. Stanton, Jeffries, sorry, how was that? Ross, Jeffries, Rouser, McCarthy, Roy. Jordan. Ruiz. Jeffries. Ruppersberger. Jeffries. Rutherford. McCarthy. Ryan Jeffries Salazar McCarthy Salinas Jeffries Sanchez 
Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Santos. McCarthy. Sarbanes. Jeffries. Scalise. McCarthy. Scanlon. Jeffries. Schakowsky. Jeffries. Schiff. Jeffries. Schneider. Jeffries. Scolton. Jeffries. Schreier. Jeffries. Schweigert. McCarthy. Austin Scott. McCarthy. David Scott. Jeffries. Scott of Virginia. Jeffries. Self. Jordan. Sessions. McCarthy. Sewell. Jeffries. Sherman. Jeffries. Cheryl. Jeffries. Simpson. McCarthy. Slotkin. Jeffries. Smith of Missouri. McCarthy. Smith of Nebraska. Smith of Nebraska. Smith of New Jersey. McCarthy. Smith of Washington. Jeffries. Smucker. McCarthy. Sorensen. Jeffries. Soto. Jeffries. Spanberger. Jeffries. Sparks. McCarthy. Stansbury. Jeffries. Stanton. Jeffries. Stauber. McCarthy. Steele. McCarthy. Stefanik. McCarthy. Style. McCarthy. Stuby. McCarthy. Stevens. Jeffries. Stewart. McCarthy. Strickland. Jeffries. Strong. McCarthy. Swalwell. Jeffries. Sykes. Jeffries. Takano. <laughs> Jeffries. Tenney. McCarthy. Tanadar. Tanadar. Jeffries. Thompson of California. Jeffries. Thompson of Mississippi. 
Jeffries. Thompson of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Tiffany. McCarthy. Timmons. McCarthy. Titus. Jeffries. Talib. Jeffries. Takuda. Jeffries. Tonko. Jeffries. Torres of California. Jeffries. Torres of New York. Jeffries. Trahan. Jeffries. Trone. Jeffries. Turner. McCarthy. Underwood. Jeffries. Valadeo. McCarthy. Van Drew. McCarthy. Van Dyne. McCarthy. Van Orden. McCarthy. Vargas. Jeffries. Vasquez. Jeffries. VC. Jeffries. Velasquez. Jeffries. Wagner. McCarthy. Wahlberg. McCarthy. Waltz. McCarthy. Washerman Schultz. Jeffries. Waters. Jeffries. Watson Coleman. Jeffries. Weber of Texas. McCarthy. Webster of Florida. Webster of Florida. Winstrom. McCarthy. Westerman. McCarthy. Wexton. Jeffries. Wild. Jeffries. Williams of Georgia. Jeffries. Williams of New York. McCarthy. Williams of Texas. McCarthy. Wilson of Florida. Jeffries. Wilson of South Carolina. McCarthy. Whitman. McCarthy. Womack. McCarthy. Yakum. McCarthy. Zinke. McCarthy. of the representatives elect who did not answer the first call of the roll.
Jeffries. Deloro. Jeffries. Gallego. Jeffries. Smith of Nebraska, McCarthy, Webster of Florida, McCarthy. Republican leader Kevin McCarthy appears to have lost his second bid for speaker in the second ballot happening on the House floor. The 19 Republicans who voted uh, against him in the first ballot have done so again. In the first round of voting, they split their vote. In the second round of voting, all 19 voted for Jim Jordan to be speaker, despite the Ohio Republican giving the nominating speech asking Republicans to vote for Kevin McCarthy. The tally showing that uh, Hakeem Jeffries, the Democratic leader from New York, has more votes uh, than Kevin McCarthy, but does, he does not have the majority of the votes of those voting today. So we will wait for the clerk to call the official count. But as we said, it appears we are headed toward a third round of balloting of ballots for Speaker of the House.
Once again, if you're just joining us for our live coverage here on C-SPAN of the House floor, the uh, second ballot for speaker uh, is, is it, it has not uh, produced a speaker. The uh, 19 Republicans who voted against Kevin McCarthy, the first ballot, have done so again. Robert Costa reports for CBS News saying that Congressman Jim Costa, no relation to him, a blue dog Democrat, tells CBS News that if the GOP doesn't get it together, the rank and file on the Republican side should consider a coalition government in the House. Costa says he has spoken to Fred Upton, a Republican, Frank Lucas, another Republican, about the idea if it got there. Now, uh, Reed Epstein uh, tweeting out that the RNC chairwoman, Ronna McDaniel, on Fox News earlier today about these rounds of votes for speaker, quote, this Republican on Republican infighting is only hurting one thing, our party.
happening on the floor now on the first day of the 118th Congress. The uh, former Speaker of the House, Nancy Pelosi, talking with the new Democratic leadership team, Hakeem Jeffries, Catherine Clark, Clark, Pete Aguilar, circled on the House floor as they wait for the clerk to announce the official tally of the second round of voting for Speaker. The Republicans have the majority. Kevin McCarthy, their leader, has not secured the votes to become Speaker yet. Of the 19 that voted against him in the first round, all 19 voted, rejected him again in the second round. One of them was Congressman, is Congressman Bob Good of Virginia, tweeting out, Kevin McCarthy is only willing to compromise when his position of personal power is at stake. America deserves a leader in the House who is wholly dedicated to preserving the nation. Then you have Congressman Don Bacon, Republican of Nebraska, who says he will continue to vote for Kevin McCarthy, saying, we have pressing work to do for Americans, including fixing the economy, growing energy independence, and securing the border. The far majority of conference supports McCarthy, but a few are holding us hostage.
despite having the majority of Republicans appear to be at a stalemate uh, over who should serve as their speaker in the 118th Congress. After two rounds of ballots, Kevin McCarthy, the Republican leader, has not secured enough votes. He has the majority of Republican votes, but he does not have, after two rounds, the majority of those voting in the chamber. The magic number is 218, and he does not have that. 19 Republicans voted against him in the first two rounds of voting. Manu Raju of CNN tweeting, conservatives will vote for Jim Jordan on the third ballot too, according to Virginia Congressman Bob Good, who has been one of those 19. He told me he expect Jordan's support to grow. Here's a quote, and I think we're going to see his numbers grow. He said the fact that Jordan doesn't want the gavel is, quote, exactly why they want him. Uh, then you have Elena Treen of Axios saying she just asked Congressman Clyburn, a Democrat, South Carolina, if he foresees any kind of situation where Democrats may end up leaving the chamber and it lowers the threshold for McCarthy, quote, no, I don't think so, no. Live coverage here on C-SPAN as the House continues its, it, uh, to, to hold this vote for Speaker. We're waiting for the clerk to call the official tally of the second round of voting.
While we continue to wait for the official tally of the second round of voting for Speaker of the House, an update for you uh, on what's happening off the floor. Elena Treen of Axios reporting that Ralph Norman, a Republican of Oklahoma, one of the original five who said they would never vote for Kevin McCarthy, tells her and the other anti tells her that he and the other anti-McCarthy Republicans are going to hold firm and said he's gotten commitments from others that make him believe the opposition will grow. He anticipates, quote, a move to adjourn at some point, but says, quote, we don't want to do that. He also told Elena Treen of Axios, there's no magic about getting it done today. Heather Cagle, uh, Cagle reporting uh, also that Steve Scalise, the number two, the second in command for Republicans, emerges from the majority leader's office saying, quote, everybody knew that this would be going on and we're going to work through it. Again, we're, we're waiting to see what happens after the official tally is called for this second vote. We expect there would be a third round of voting. Live coverage here on C-SPAN.
You're watching C-SPAN's live coverage of the vote for speaker. They have just finished their second round of ballots, and we're expecting a third round of voting to begin. Sahil Kapoor of NBC reporting. House Democratic whip Catherine Clark's office tells lawmakers another vote is expected soon and to stay close, quote, please remain near the floor. The reason? Democratic absences equals lower threshold equals potentially easier for McCarthy to get elected speaker. Chip Roy, one of the members, one of those 19 Republicans who have, who have rejected Kevin McCarthy as speaker, he was on Fox News saying, we're not going to back down until we get in a room and we decide how we'll be able to stand up and fight for the American people no matter who the speaker is I'm not blinking, he tells the network. And Representative Andy Biggs, one of the leaders of the so-called anti-McCarthy movement, tweeting out that Kevin McCarthy has lost two ballots already. It's time to move on. Continue watching here on C-SPAN on our website, cspan.org. And you can also follow along with our mobile app, C-SPAN Now. It has been 100 years since the House voted in multiple ballots for Speaker of the House. We just finished here uh, on the House floor the second round of voting. It appears the U.S. House is headed for a third round of voting for Speaker. There have been 14 times where it took more than two ballots for a nominee to become Speaker. 13 of those instances occurred before the Civil War. The longest Speaker election on record lasted two months. Between December 1855 and February 1856, lawmakers had to cast 133 ballots before finally electing a speaker. The last time a speaker election multi lasted multiple ballots uh, was in 1923, as we said, 100 years ago, when it took nine ballots to elect a speaker. We are headed toward 
the third round. Caitlin Collins of CNN tweeting out a quote from Dave Joyce, who is a supporter of Kevin McCarthy, telling CNN, we are going to continue to vote until Kevin's the next speaker. just saw Kevin McCarthy, the leader of the Republicans in the House, on the floor. 
uh, after the second round of ballots did not produce a, enough votes for him to become speaker. We are approaching the fourth hour of this new 118th Congress, and the House has not gotten past the vote for speaker. They had an agenda that they wanted to get to today after uh, voting for the speaker, which was uh, swearing in the newly elected members of Congress, uh, the debating and voting on a rules package for this next Congress, the next two years. And they also plan to consider a piece of legislation, a bill to rescind funding for 87,000 new, new IRS agents that was alloc uh, allocated in the Inflation Reduction Act. They have yet to get to that part of their agenda today. It looks like they're headed for a third round of voting for Speaker Scott McFarland, who reports for CBS, has a quote here from Kevin McCarthy, the leader, telling reporters, we're unified. This isn't about me. This is about the conference now because the members who are holding out, it is what they want, something for their personal selves. We'll keep you cover coverage going here on C-SPAN. You can also watch on our website, cspan.org, or on our free mobile app, C-SPAN Now. the house be in order
The tellers agree in their tallies that the total number of votes cast is 434, of which the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries of the State of New York has received 212. Honorable Kevin McCarthy of the State of California has received 203. <laughs> the Honorable Jim Jordan of the State of Ohio has received 19. No person having received the majority of the whole number of votes cast by surname, a speaker has not been elected. For what purpose does the gentleman from Louisiana rise? Madam Clerk, I rise to nominate Kevin McCarthy for the position of Speaker of the House. The gentleman is recognized. The gentleman is recognized. Thank you, Madam Clerk. We all came here to get things done, to get big things done, to solve the problems. And I hope when we get through today that all of the members on both sides of the aisle will join together with us to solve the problems, to address inflation that is crushing middle class families, to get control over spending that's Madam driving Yale, that inflation, will the Madam Clerk. Yale, will the House be in order? And we all know what those problems are. We've been talking about them for a long time. We've been proposing legislation for a long time. In fact, it was Kevin McCarthy who put together task forces over a year ago to get members engaged in the process of not just talking about what we don't like, not just talking about what the problems are. We know what those problems are. But how do you fix those problems? And so we started rolling those bills out. We've attempted to bring bills on this floor to address inflation, to lower the cost of goods when families go to the grocery store and they can't even buy all the food they need for their families if they can find that food on their shelf. But those bills were rejected. If a family has trouble putting gas in the tank to make it to the grocery store because we've got such horrible energy policies under what President Biden's done to shut down American energy that families can't even afford to put gas in their tanks. And so we brought legislation to the floor to lower the cost of gasoline. And you know what? Those bills were rejected by the previous majority. And I use that term for a reason, previous majority, because we want a majority talking about fixing those problems. But we can't start fixing those problems until we elect Kevin McCarthy as our next speaker. And so what have we laid out? We've got bills just this week to start addressing some of those problems, to start addressing our energy insecurity that's been created when President Biden shut down American energy. There is absolutely no reason that we need to rely on foreign countries to produce our energy. We could produce it all here, cleaner, better, more efficient, and create American jobs in the process. Let's get those bills to this floor. How long have we been highlighting this open southern border? That's not just brought millions of people across our border. Kevin McCarthy's led delegations down to the border to show what the problem is. We know what the problem is. This president refuses to even admit the problem. It's kind of hard for the president to solve a problem when he doesn't even admit it's a problem. Yet let's talk about the numbers. Over 2 million people have come across our border illegally just last year. That's more than the entire state of New Mexico have come into our country illegal, and this president won't even admit it's a problem. Last year alone, we lost over 100,000 young people to deaths from drugs like fentanyl because we have an open southern border. Everybody should be appalled by that stat, the fact that more than 100 of our youngest, best and brightest kids are dead in America because of the fentanyl coming across of our open southern border. These are drugs made in China coming across our southern border and brought into every community in America. And it should stop. It has to stop, but it won't stop until either the president takes action, which he won't, 
or we pass legislation on the floor to fix those problems. But that doesn't start until we elect Kevin McCarthy as our speaker. We know what the challenges are. We've laid out solutions to these problems. It's sad to say these aren't problems that are very hard to fix because we weren't in this situation just a few years ago. But if the administration doesn't want to fix these problems, people call on us to do that. And it starts here in the people's house. Let's rise to this challenge. Let's meet the challenges that the American people sent to all of us, not just the Republicans, not just the Democrats, but all 434, soon to be 435 of us. We can meet those challenges, but let's start by electing Kevin McCarthy as our next speaker. I yield back. For what purpose does the gentleman from California rise? Madam Clerk, I rise to nominate Hakeem Jeffries. For unity in the Congress. has been recognized. For unity in con Congress and progress in our country, Democrats are united behind Hakeem Jeffries. I recommend Hakeem Jeffries as our speaker. Thank you, Madam Clerk. prepared to call the roll. For what purpose does the gentleman from Texas seek recognition? Seek to place the name and a nomination, Speaker. The gentleman is recognized. So this is what the chamber looks like when we're actually debating and the bodies are in the chairs. How many times have we been down here giving speeches and there's not a soul in the chamber? Yet this is what it takes to get 440, 435 people in the chamber and have an actual debate. The American people are watching, and that's a good thing. What we're doing is exercising our rights to vote and have a debate and have a discussion about the future of this country through the decision of choosing a speaker. This is not personal. It's not. This is about the future of the country. This is about the direction of the country. American people who are looking at this body and wondering why we can pass $1.7 trillion bills that are unpaid for. They can just slide in $45 billion for Ukraine but not pay for it. $40 billion for emergency spending and not pay for it. 10% increase in defense spending, 6% increase in non-defense spending and not pay for it. And not do a thing except put language in a bill that prohibits our ability to use the money to secure the border. That bill gets rammed through, and we know exactly how it gets rammed through, because the defense world and the non-defense world come together and say, you know what, we're going to cut a deal, and we'll all go to the mics, and we'll all go give speeches, and the American people are the big losers. That's what happens. We know that's what happens. The Rules Committee sits up there and passes a bill, sends it to the floor, and we have no debate on the floor of this body. We haven't been able to offer an amendment on the floor of this body since May of 2016. The former leader and I have discussed this right here. That's true. But the fact is, this place has to change. It has to change. And the change comes by either adopting rules and procedures that will make us actually do our job, or it comes from leadership. And people ask me, what do you want? I want the tools or I want the leadership to stop the swamp from running over the average American every single day. We can't keep doing this. I'm going to sit here until we figure out how to stop spending money we don't have. I don't want any more empty promises. I don't want any more, oh, don't worry, trust us, we'll do it. I want to know that we're going to be able to exercise our rights as a member of this body to stand up for the American people and actually fix this country. And it's not going to happen 
when we use our men and women in uniform in defense and wrap ourselves around that and then spend more money that we don't have, weakening that defense, weakening our country in the process. But that's what we just did. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am asking for us to come together and figure out how to solve these problems. And to do that, I'm going to do what I did my very first act as a member of Congress or as a congressman-elect and nominate Jim Jordan for speaker. <laughs> now, Jim has said he doesn't want that nomination, and Jim has been, been down here nominating Kevin, and I respect that. And again, I have no personal animus towards Kevin. And I've worked for the last two months to try to figure out how to get the rules to make this place better, and we've made progress. But we do not have the tools or the leadership yet to stop the swamp for rolling over the American people. Jim has been doing it. He has a track record of doing it. And for those reasons, I am nominating Jim Jordan from Ohio for Speaker of the House of Representatives. The reading clerk will call the roll. Jeffries, Adderholt, McCarthy, Aguilar, Jeffries, Alford, McCarthy, Allen, McCarthy, Allred, Jeffries, Emma Day. McCarthy, Armstrong, McCarthy, Arrington, McCarthy, Auchincloss, Jeffries, Babin, McCarthy, Bacon, McCarthy, Baird, McCarthy, Balderson, McCarthy, Ballant, Jeffries, Banks, McCarthy, Barr, McCarthy, Berrigan, Jeffries, Bean of Florida. McCarthy, Beatty, Jeffries, Bentz, McCarthy, Barra, Jeffries, Bergman, McCarthy, Byer, Jeffries, Bice, McCarthy, Biggs, Jordan, Villaracus, McCarthy, Bishop of Georgia, Jeffries, Bishop of North Carolina, Jordan. Blumenauer. Blumenauer. Blunt Rochester. Jeffries. Bobert. Jordan. Bonamici, Jeffries, Bost, 
McCarthy. Bowman. Jeffries. Jeffries. Boyle of Pennsylvania. Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Rakeem. Jordan. Brown. Jeffries. Jeffries. Brownlee. Jeffries. Buchanan. McCarthy. Buck. McCarthy. Bouchon. McCarthy. Bazinski. Jeffries. Burchett. McCarthy. Burgess. McCarthy. Burlinson. McCarthy. Bush. Jeffries. Calvert. McCarthy. Kamek. McCarthy. Caraveo. Jeffries. Carbajal. Carbajal. Jeffries. Cardenas. Jeffries. Carey. McCarthy. Carl. McCarthy. Carson. Jeffries. Carter of Georgia. Carter of Georgia. Carter of Louisiana. Carter of Louisiana probably votes for Keem Jeffries. Jeffries. Carter of Texas. McCarthy. Cartwright. Jeffries. Jeffries. Kassar. Jeffries. Case. Jeffries. Caston. Jeffries. Castor of Florida. Jeffries. Castro of Texas. Jeffries. Chavez de Reamer. McCarthy. Sherfulis McCormick. Jeffries. Chu. Jeffries. Cicilline. Jeffries. Siscobani. McCarthy. Clark of Massachusetts. Jeffries. Clark of New York. Jeffries. Cleaver, Jeffries, Klein, McCarthy, Cloud, Jordan, Clyburn, Jeffries, Clyde, Jordan. Cohen. Not Jackie Robinson, but Brooklyn's 21st century star, Hakeem Jeffries. Jeffries. Cole. McCarthy. Collins. McCarthy. Comer. McCarthy. Connolly. <laughs> Jeffries. Correa. Jeffries. Costa. Jeffries. Courtney. Jeffries. Craig. Jeffries. 
Ukraine. Jordan. Crawford. McCarthy. Crenshaw. McCarthy. Crockett. Jeffries. Crow. Jeffries. Cuellar. Jeffries. Curtis. McCarthy. Davis of Kansas. Davids of Kansas. Jeffries. Davidson. McCarthy. Davis of Illinois. Jeffries. Davis of North Carolina. Jeffries. Dean of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. Deget. Jeffries. Dela Cruz. McCarthy. Deloro. Jeffries. Del Bene. Jeffries. Deluzio. Jeffries. Desaunier. Jeffries. Desjardins. McCarthy. Diaz Pizzito. McCarthy, Diaz Ballart, McCarthy, Dingle, Jeffries, Doggett, Jeffries, Donalds, Jordan. Duarte, McCarthy, Duncan, McCarthy, Dunn of Florida, McCarthy, Edwards, McCarthy, Elsie, McCarthy, Emmer McCarthy Escobar Jeffries Eshu Jeffries Espayat Jeffries Estes McCarthy Evans Jeffries Ezel McCarthy, Fallon, McCarthy, Finstra, McCarthy, Ferguson, McCarthy, Finstad, McCarthy, Fishbach, McCarthy, Fitzgerald, McCarthy, Fitzpatrick, McCarthy, Fleischman, McCarthy, Fletcher, Jeffries, Flood, McCarthy, Foster, Jeffries, Falshi, Jeffries. Fox. McCarthy. Lois Frankel. Jeffries. C. Scott Franklin. McCarthy. Frost. Jeffries. Fry. McCarthy. Fulcher. McCarthy, Gates, Jordan.
Gallagher. McCarthy. McCarthy. Gallego. Jeffries. Garamendi. Jeffries. Garbarino. McCarthy. Mike Garcia. McCarthy. Robert Garcia. Jeffries. Garcia of Illinois. Jeffries. Garcia of Texas. Jeffries. Jimenez. McCarthy. Golden of Maine. Jeffries. Goldman of New York. Jeffries. Gomez. Gomez. Tony Gonzalez. McCarthy. Vicente Gonzalez. Jeffries. Good of Virginia. Jordan. Gooden of Texas, McCarthy. Gosar, Jordan. Gottheimer, Jeffries. Granger, McCarthy. Graves of Louisiana, McCarthy. Graves of Missouri, McCarthy. Green of Tennessee, McCarthy. Green of Texas, <coughs> Jeffries. Green of Georgia, McCarthy. Griffith. McCarthy, Grijalva, Jeffries, Grothman, McCarthy, Guest, McCarthy, Guthrie, McCarthy, Hageman, McCarthy, Harder of California, Jeffries, Harris, Jordan. Harsbarger, McCarthy, Hayes, Jeffries, Hearn, McCarthy. Higgins of Louisiana, McCarthy. Higgins of New York, Jeffries. Hill, McCarthy. Himes, Jeffries. Henson, McCarthy. Horsford, Jeffries. Houchin, McCarthy, Houlihan, Jeffries, Hoyer, Jeffries, Hoyle of Oregon, Jeffries, Hudson, McCarthy, Huffman, Jeffries, Heisinga, McCarthy, Hunt, McCarthy, Isa, McCarthy, 
Ivy. Jeffries. Jackson of Illinois. Jeffries. Jackson of North Carolina. Jeffries. Jackson of Texas. McCarthy. Jackson Lee. Jeffries. Jacobs. Jeffries. James. McCarthy. Jayapal. Jeffries. 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 Johnson of Georgia. Jeffries. Johnson of Louisiana. McCarthy. Johnson of Ohio. McCarthy. Johnson of South Dakota. McCarthy. Jordan. McCarthy. Joyce of Ohio. McCarthy. Joyce of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Cam Logger Dove. Jeffries. Captor. Jeffries. Kane of New Jersey. McCarthy. Keating. Jeffries. Kelly of Illinois. Jeffries. Kelly of Mississippi. McCarthy. Kelly of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Connor. Jeffries. Jeffries. Kickens of Virginia. Kickens of Virginia. McCarthy. Kildee. Jeffries. Jeffries. <laughs> Kylie. McCarthy. Kilmer. Jeffries. Kim of California. McCarthy. Kim of New Jersey. Jeffries. Krishnamorthy. Jeffries. Custer. Jeffries. Kustoff. McCarthy. LaHood. McCarthy. LaGoida. McCarthy. LaMalfa. McCarthy. Lamborn. McCarthy. Landsman. Jeffries. Langworthy. McCarthy. Larson of Washington. Jeffries. Larson of Connecticut. Jeffries. Latta. McCarthy. Laturner. McCarthy. Lawler. McCarthy. Lee of California. Jeffries. Lee of Florida. McCarthy. Lee of Nevada. Jeffries. Lee of Pennsylvania. Jeffries. Ledger Fernandez. 
Jeffries, Lesko, McCarthy, Letlow, McCarthy, Levin, Jeffries, Lou, Jeffries, Lofgren, Jeffries, Louder Milk, McCarthy, Lucas, McCarthy, Luke Kameyer, McCarthy, Luna, Jordan. Latrell, McCarthy, Lynch, Jeffries, Mace, McCarthy, Magaziner, Jeffries, Maliotakis, McCarthy, Mann, McCarthy, Manning, Jeffries, Massey, McCarthy, Mast, McCarthy, Matsui, Jeffries, McBath, Jeffries, McCarthy, McCarthy. McCall, McCarthy, McLean, McCarthy, McClintock, McCarthy, McCollum, Jeffries, McCormick, McCarthy, McGarvey, Jeffries, McGovern, Jeffries, McHenry, McCarthy, Meeks, Jeffries, Menendez, Jeffries, Me, Jeffries, Muser, McCarthy, Infume, Jeffries, Miller of Illinois, Jordan, Miller of Ohio, McCarthy, Miller of West Virginia, McCarthy, Miller Meeks, McCarthy, Mills, McCarthy, Molinaro, McCarthy, Molinar, McCarthy, Mooney, McCarthy, Moore of Alabama, McCarthy, Moore of Utah, McCarthy, Moore of Wisconsin, <coughs> Jeffries, Moran, McCarthy, Morelli, Jeffries, Muskowitz, Jeffries, Moulton, Jeffries, Mervan, Jeffries, Mullen, Jeffries, Murphy, McCarthy, Nadler, Jeffries, Napolitano, Jeffries, Neil, Jeffries, Nagoose, 
Jeffries, Nels, McCarthy, Newhouse, McCarthy, Nickel, Jeffries, Norcross, Jeffries, Norman, Jordan, Nunn of Iowa, McCarthy, Obernolte, McCarthy, Ocasio Cortez, Ocasio Cortez. Ogles, Jordan, Omar, Omar, Jeffries, Owens, McCarthy, Palone, Jeffries, Palmer, McCarthy, Panetta, Jeffries, Pappas, Jeffries, Pasquale, Jeffries, Payne, Jeffries, Pelosi, Jeffries, Peltola, Jeffries, Pence, McCarthy, Perez, Jeffries, Perry, Jordan. Peters, Jeffries, Pedersen, Jeffries, Pfluger, McCarthy, Phillips, Jeffries, Pinkery, Jeffries, Pocan, Jeffries, Porter, Jeffries, Posey, McCarthy, Presley, Jeffries, Quigley, Jeffries, Ramirez, Jeffries, Raskin, Jeffries, Reschenthaler, McCarthy, Rogers of Washington, McCarthy, Rogers of Alabama, McCarthy, Rogers of Kentucky, McCarthy, Rose, McCarthy, Rosendell, Jordan, Ross, Jeffries, Rouser, McCarthy, Roy, Jordan. Ruiz, Jeffries, Rupersberger, Jeffries, Rutherford, Rutherford, McCarthy, 
McCarthy. Ryan. Jeffries. Salazar. McCarthy. Salinas. Jeffries. Sanchez. Jeffries. Santos. McCarthy. Sarbanes. Jeffries. Scalise. McCarthy. Scanlon. Jeffries. Schakowsky. Jeffries. Schiff. Jeffries. Snyder. Jeffries. Skolton. Jeffries. Schreier. Jeffries. Swikert. McCarthy. Austin Scott. McCarthy. David Scott. Jeffries. Scott of Virginia. Jeffries. Self. Jordan. Sessions. McCarthy. Sewell. Jeffries. Sherman. Jeffries. Cheryl. Jeffries. Simpson. McCarthy. Slotkin. Jeffries. Smith of Missouri. McCarthy. Smith of Nebraska. McCarthy. Smith of New Jersey. McCarthy. Smith of Washington. Jeffries. Smucker. McCarthy. Sorensen. Jeffries. Soto. Jeffries. Spamberger. Jeffries. Sparts. McCarthy. Stansberry. Jeffries. Stanton. Jeffries. Stalber. McCarthy. Steele. McCarthy. Stefanik. McCarthy. Style. McCarthy. Stuby. McCarthy. Stevens. Jeffries. Stewart. McCarthy. Strickland. With Jeffries. Strong. McCarthy. Swalwell. Jeffries. Sykes. Jeffries. Takano. Jeffries. Tenney. McCarthy. Tanadar. Jeffries. Thompson of California. Jeffries. Thompson of Mississippi. Thompson of Mississippi. Jeffries. Thompson of Pennsylvania. McCarthy. Tiffany. McCarthy. Timmons. McCarthy. Titus. 
Titus. To lead, Jeffries. To Kuda, Jeffries. Tonko, Jeffries. Torres of California, Jeffries. Torres of New York, Jeffries. Trahan, Jeffries. Trim, Jeffries. Turner, McCarthy. Underwood, Jeffries. Valadeo, McCarthy. Van Drew. McCarthy, Van Dyne, McCarthy, Van Orden, McCarthy, Vargas, Jeffries, Vasquez, Jeffries, VC, Jeffries, Velasquez, Jeffries. Wagner, McCarthy, Wahlberg, McCarthy, Waltz, McCarthy, Wasserman Schultz, Jeffries, Waters, Jeffries, Watson Coleman, Jeffries, Weber of Texas, McCarthy, Webster of Florida, McCarthy, Winstrup, McCarthy, Westerman, McCarthy, Wexton, Jeffries, Wild, Jeffries, Williams of Georgia, Jeffries, Williams of New York, McCarthy, Williams of Texas, McCarthy, Wilson of Florida, Jeffries, Wilson of South Carolina, McCarthy, Whitman, McCarthy, Womack, McCarthy, Yakum, McCarthy, Zinke, McCarthy. of the representatives elect who did not answer the first call of the roll. Blumenauer, Jeffries. Carter of Georgia, McCarthy.
Ocasio-Cortez. Jeffries. Titus. Jeffries. Republican leader Kevin McCarthy has lost his bid again to be speaker in the third round of voting. First two rounds saw 19 defections. There were 19 again, and they were joined by another Republican, making it 20 Republicans who opposed Kevin McCarthy for speaker. The 20th vote was Byron Donalds, Republican of Florida, serving in his second term. Robert Costa of CBS tweeting out, I'm hearing some of the hardliners are hoping a large enough group wants to adjourn. And most of them would support that as a means of having a conference meeting to hash things out. The question is, would some Democrats back a motion to adjourn? And Kevin McCarthy has said he doesn't want to leave the floor. If they don't adjourn, it looks like the House is headed for an historic fourth round of voting for speaker. Continue to watch our coverage here live on C-SPAN.
Once again, on the opening day of the 118th Congress, no one has secured the votes to become the next Speaker of the House. 19 Republicans, along with Byron Donalds, making it 20, voted against Kevin McCarthy in the last round of voting. Congressman Donalds tweeting this out just moments ago. The reality is Representative Kevin McCarthy doesn't have the votes. I committed my support to him publicly and for two votes on the House floor. 218 is the number, and currently no one is there. Our conference needs to recess and huddle and find someone or work out the next steps, he wrote. He went on to say, but these continuous votes aren't working for anyone. When the dust settles, we will have a Republican speaker. Now is the time for our conference to debate and come to a consensus. In support for Kevin McCarthy, Marjorie Taylor Greene of Georgia tweeting out, Jim Jordan does not want to be speaker and nominated Kevin McCarthy on the House floor for speaker and is voting for him every round. Jim Jordan wants to be chair of the judiciary, but he can't because 19 Republicans, now 20 in the third round of voting, are not supporting Jim Jordan by voting for McCarthy. We're waiting for the clerk to call the official tally of the third round of voting, and then we will see what happens next. Do they adjourn, or does this go to a fourth ballot?
Live coverage of the House floor. You can see Elise Stefanik, the Republican from New York, who gave the, no the first nominating speech for Kevin McCarthy to be Speaker. That started uh, in the first, in the noon hour today. We are now in our fifth hour of the 118th Congress. Republicans at a stalemate over who should be their Speaker in this new Congress. They have the majority. But they cannot get Kevin McCarthy, the leader of the Republicans, cannot get a majority of those of those voting to vote for him today. There's lots of reporting on Capitol Hill about what happens next. Do they adjourn? And if they do, they would need 218 votes to do so. This means Democrats would have to vote for it, according to CNN. Unclear if they would. And leader Kevin McCarthy wants to keep voting. They don't adjourn. We're expecting a fourth round of voting. Live coverage here on C-SPAN. On your screen now is Congressman Tom Emmer, who is part of the Republican leadership team. He's the whip counter for the 118th Congress. You can see him talking there to Andy Biggs of Arizona, one of the leaders of opposition to Kevin McCarthy becoming the next Speaker of the House. Again, they have just concluded on the House floor the third round of voting. California Republican Kevin McCarthy failing to get the votes he needs, 20 Republicans rejecting him as speaker. We will continue our coverage here on C-SPAN. Wait to see what happens next. Do they adjourn or is there another, a fourth round of voting?
In a third bid for Speaker, California Republican Kevin McCarthy failed to secure the votes needed of the 434 voting. He needs 218. 20 Republicans have opposed his speakership. Uh, 19 in the first two rounds, and then it grew to 20 with Byron Donalds joining those other Republicans in the third round. Jake Sherman of Punchbowl News is tweeting out, there is talk in the House Republican ranks that there will be an attempt to adjourn until tomorrow. He notes that Chip Roy of Texas, who's part of those 20 Republicans uh, opposing Kevin McCarthy is talking to a McCarthy deputy in the middle of the House floor. Our coverage continues here on C-SPAN. The tellers agree in their tallies that the total number of votes cast is 434, of which the Honorable Hakeem Jeffries of the State of New York has received 212.
The Honorable Kevin McCarthy of the State of California has received 202. The Honorable Jim Jordan of the State of Ohio has received 20. No person having received the majority of the whole number of votes cast by surname, a speaker has not been elected. For what purpose does the gentleman from Oklahoma rise? I move to adjourn until noon tomorrow. The question is on the motion. The question is on the motion. All those in favor say aye. All those in favor say aye. All those opposed, no. no. The ayes have it. The motion is adopted. The House stands adjourned until noon tomorrow. After an historic three rounds of voting for Speaker on the opening day of the 118th Congress, Republicans were at a stalemate and could not elect one of their own to be Speaker of the House in this new Congress while they have the majority. You just saw they adjourned by unanimous consent. They'll come back tomorrow at noon. We want to get your reaction to what happened today on the House floor. To Democrats dialing at 202-748-8920. Republicans, 202-748-8921. All others, your line this evening, 202-748-8922. You can send us a tweet as well with the handle at C-SPAN or join us on Facebook.com slash C-SPAN for the conversation. Again, California Republican Kevin McCarthy unable to get the votes he needed to be Speaker of the House. He was elected the party's leader behind closed doors.